So we come to the first move of the Hitler Yoga Pilates Qigong sequence. A bit of a mixture, just mixing up the breathing um, within the sequences and linking that to the Qigong posture. The first move of the eight brocades. It's not pretty much, the, it's just the movements of the eight brocades because if you was doing it traditionally, we'd be going through the meridians, etc. I've done that a little bit more in other videos. But we're just going to add this in. It's breath synchronized mo motion, really, vinyasa, like in yoga, synchronize and calibrate and synchronize the breath and the motion with the breathing. We go a little bit in depth. So, can keep this sort of basic here zip up pelvic floor, scoop out the abdominals. They go naturally together. You can't do one without the other. If you zip up pelvic floor, the corset, muscle, three layers deep will wrap on. And same here, if you tuck in the belly button there and get the corset muscle, that will engage pelvic floor. The other way so basically they both work together so i say them together anyway zip up pelvic floor scoop out your abdominals take the navel towards the spine i'm going to keep this basic now could go a lot more depth i have done with the more pilates orientated videos but again that helps you breathe low and deep into these lower lobes of the lungs anywhere but the stomach so you can use the corset muscle three layers deep which segmentally helps you stabilize the spine that's what you do in pilates the difference is we're not going to be exhaling through per slips. So we're going to breathe in and out through the nose. So it becomes yogic breath in that way. A smaller filter through the nose. And it helps us lengthen the breath longer. Especially that lovely elongated out breath. Okay. And that will make that hypnotic breath. Okay. So start with that. Then we might add the ujjayi breath. We're going to add the ujjayi breath. So zip up pelvic floor. Scoop out the abdominals. Breathing out through the nose. And you'll, have, you'll see how long that breath is. Okay, that smaller filter through the nose helps filter the breath. And it's more cleansing breath, yogic breath there. Okay, if you want to add the ujjayi breath, where you grip at your esophagus. And it makes this sound. A sign whistling, silky breath, ujjayi breath, victorious breath. Helps us lengthen the breath even longer. Helps us stimulate the thyroid gland, which helps with weight control, etc. Helps us build the heat within the body. As we zip up pelvic floor, scoop out the abdominals. Quite similar to Ashtanga, but not bang on it. Similar-ish, they gather in, and they also breathe it out through the nose. Unlike Pilates, we'll exhale through pursed lips to fire the corset in the powerhouse, the girdle strength more. But again, I digress there. We're gonna simply stick, zip up pelvic floor, scoop out the abdominals, breathe in through the nose. As you grip at the esophagus and exhale. And see how long that breath takes. Again, that gives the mind something to focus on within the form or the calibrated motion and helps stimulate the mind gives you something to focus on helps you lengthen the breath even longer gives the mind something to focus on basically so as you do that you'll find you will naturally fall on the out breath and that will naturally want to elongate okay so with the hypnotic breath the in breath conscious thought, the out breath subconscious thought. Sometimes called 7 11 breathing, whatever it is, it could be 5 and 9 or whatever it is. Make the out breath longer than the in breath. Don't force anything. It could be a little bit longer or a lot longer. Again, just naturally let it fall as long as it wants to go. And that will bring in the hypnotic responses. In breath conscious thought, out breath is subconscious thought. So by extending the out breath longer than the in breath, we're encouraging sleep digestion, rest, and relaxation, all on that lovely elongated out breath. Lovely, so we're gonna do that and then link it to a nice basic motion, um, supporting the heavens, the first move. So again, it's a. And with the motion, it's a nice simple motion, clasp the hands, coming up here around the crown and you're breathing as you're coming up so again it's uh and then you exhale
send it down with our hands. Again, you're doing this motion, so you feel that stretch, your little pinkies, little fingers. Again, believe there'll be the heart meridian. So again, I'm gonna come, I'm gonna move over here, so we've got a little bit more space. So from here, it's uh, Clasp the hands, you're breathing, come up to crown. Let me turn the hands. And this will be a longer breath as you're descending down. This will put the shoulders in a really nice position as well. If you want to go deeper, you can go deeper with Evel, as with all Qigong postures, just stand naturally or just come up here. Again, push away the walls, Samson style. For that stretch, your little pinkies, little fingers, opens out the chest, and all the organs in the chest, the heart, the lungs, the pericardium, the heart lining, all being opened out like a book. It's always nice to open out the chest because we take, spend a lot of time like this, compressed against gravity. And again, just link that breath to the motion. You'll find you'll naturally want to elongate the out breath longer than the in breath. As you zip up pelvic force, scoop out the abdominals. Let's go a few more times. Breathing coming up. And just feel that descend of the out breath as you come down. That lovely elongated out breath. Lovely. And just work with that. And the next move is raising the hands, or raise both hands, sorry, lifting the hands even, to raise the condition of the stomach and the spleen, bit of a mouthful, okay, um, called different things in other forms, similar names, but it's just the movement we're focused on here and calibrating and synchronizing the breath and the motion. And again, it's a real nice one. Um, Within the traditional forms, this helps to triple heat, as it's like the immune system, meridian, in a way to explain very briefly. Um, but again, just breathing will benefit every single cell, sinew, body, with the trillions of cells in the body, that will benefit every single one, because that breath will reach every single one there, and that will manifest in every single organ, cell, sinew of the body. Lovely, that was number one of the yogic Pilates hypno Qigong sequence. Lovely, bang.